This drill is focused on overhead mobility, so we're gonna get a little bit of shoulders and spine working together as we go through this movement. So you're gonna start, put your butt against the wall, tailbone is as close as possible. You're gonna tuck your pelvis slightly to get that, that lower back flat, T-spine follows, and your head and your neck is the last to be put against the wall. Make sure that you don't just tilt your head back like this. You are tucking your chin so that your head, your cervical spine, thoracic, lumbar, straight line, making contact with the wall. Your breathing is very important in this drill. If you can create enough core tension when you initiate the movement, you're gonna be able to pull yourself against the wall and get more out of your range of motion. So we're gonna start here. Your arms are gonna go straight out just like this. Shoulder height, you're gonna protract your shoulder blades as far as you can get them, and you're gonna initiate the rep with a deep breath in through your nose. Find that core tension, hold it, and then bring the arms overhead as far back as possible without losing contact with the wall. <sighs> Slow and controlled path up. Breathe out on the way back down. One more time. <sighs> Work to get your thumbs against the wall first. Once that becomes fairly easy, take the back of your hand. Make sure you're not cheating by bending the wrist or the elbows. And if you'd like an extra challenge, all you have to do is take the mini band, put it around your wrists and maintain tension on the mini band throughout the full set. Good luck, guys.